today's special guest, Stephen Douglas, is a renowned senator from Illinois who almost defeated Abraham Lincoln in the presidential nomination for the 16th president of the United States. He proposed and passed the Kansas-Nebraska Act, which gave popular sovereignty to decide on slavery. Known as the Little Giant, he was definitely not one to be feared in stature, but he was one to reckon in politics. Hello, Mr. Douglas. How are you doing today? I'm doing quite fine, sir. How about you? Uh, I'm doing fine as well. Great. Shall we proceed? Uh, you, who were a prominent figure in Congress, on top of possessing quite a large amount of power, what made you believe that the nation needed the Kansas-Nebraska Act? Well, I felt that the nation was going to tear itself apart if we keep fighting over slaves' rights. We needed a solution, not a compromise. And what makes the solution a solution and not a compromise? It is an adequate solution because it uses the notion of popular sovereignty. This is a pure democratic principle that is based on what the people want. If it is majority slave wanting, it will become a slave state. If the population does not desire their state to be slave owning, there will be a free state. Although you use popular sovereignty for people to decide on the controversial issue of slavery, what, what are your personal feelings on slavery? Well, since slavery is an issue that can break bonds between friends and fellow comrades, I try to have an unbiased opinion on any major issue like slavery. That is also precisely why I came up with the concept of popular sovereignty, where it was a way for the nation to solve its own problem using a fair method. Um, and moving on to another topic, what, kind, what was the experience of running against Abraham Lincoln for president and, to lesser known, senator. Although it is frustrating that I lost to a man I've beaten more than once in politics before, I believe that I will have my time to shine next term, with my ideas having the chance to be fully expressed. All right, sir. Uh, I thank you for joining me today to talk about these matters. It has been my pleasure hosting you, and I hope you have better luck in the next term. Thank you, sir. The pleasure has been mine. I thoroughly enjoyed our discussion. I hope we can converse again in the future. Arziyan sari 